Okay. Four on the floor, we'll talk, uh, we'll talk and it's brought to you by our friends at Citywide Banks. Control, uh, you can tell I'm not in control of this show. <laughs> four on the floor. Four topics. Woody and I each get 30. See? Four on the floor. Woody and I each get 30 seconds to, uh, to answer the question. Uh, when the 30 seconds is up, you will hear a ding. Okay, first question. Best chance to dance in 2016. See you or CSU? Well, if they know? follow my advice and let everybody in the tournament, they'd both get in. All right, CSU. CSU's going to be pissed after what just happened. They're going to go out and play extremely hard. I, I think both of them will get in next year. I think that was, this was a down year for for CU for a lot of reasons. D Dinwiddie left and, you know, he hadn't really made a mark. He should have stayed around one more year because he was hurt last year. They would have been an NCAA team, I think, with Dinwiddie. But CSU, definitely. You, Stacy's a great coach. He is a great coach. I'm going to go see you, however, because Tad Boyle is a pretty darn good coach in his well, own right. Sure, they are. And uh, and and I believe this year was an aberration. He's got a nice recruiting class coming in. Uh, I think Tad Boyle is going to be pissed and do things differently. I think his players are going to be bothered by the season they had because they're better than 13 and 15. And I think CU is going to be uh, in the dance next year, maybe even before CSU. CSU had a bunch of. Uh, it's an older team now, isn't it? CSU. He, but he figures out how He's to losing create his top score, transfers isn't he? and junior yeah. college kind of guys. All right, next question. Adrian Peterson for one year, twelve point seven five million. Is he worth it? Would you want him? You want me to go first? Well, uh, well explain to me. I, this this is avoid my intelligence. I don't know. What's Adrian going Peterson on. is under contract to the Minnesota Vikings. So sure, if they trade that. him, you have to assume his I contract. Maybe he and he's due to make twelve point seven five million this year. Um, I'll go first. Absolutely. I, I know a lot of people are afraid because of his off-the-field antics. Um, I know they look at his age and say he's approaching 30 years old, and that's the expiration date for running backs in the NFL. He is still one of the top two running backs in this league, along with uh, Marshawn Lynch. He is angry. He's fresh because he hardly played this last year. I absolutely would pay Adrian Peterson that, and I would want him on my team. You, you touched upon my first thought at the very end. He's well-rested. So that's the first thing. Yeah. The second thing, in regard to what he did, was was uh, awful. And you've had kids. I have a kid. I never touched my kid. Uh, just, but he came from an environment. That's not Davidi. He came from an environment that was acceptable behavior, and he did learn from that. He didn't learn that what he did with his kid was intolerable. It wasn't. So it was not as if he murdered someone or that the kid died, although the, one of his other kids, one of his illegitimate kids did yes. die as a result of abuse. Uh, if I was a team out there like Oakland or something, yeah, I, I, I would get him. I don't want him here in Denver. I mean, I, I don't, I think the Broncos, it, it, as much as I think everybody wants to see him in the Super Bowl, they, they want him to have people who don't have clouded, you know, it's the Parrish Cox kind of syndrome to me. Paris Cox is out there. He played pretty well for the Broncos. He had a he had a nice comeback year with the San Francisco after a couple of bad years. Do you really want him here? No. You know, leave those to the Cincinnati I would. people. Terrell Davis to John Elway, Adrian Peterson to Peyton Manning. I'd take him for a year. Spring football games. Oh, so you were talking about here. Yeah. I was well, talking no, no, about no, anywhere. 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 Yeah. If I no, owned any team, if I was I a GM would, of any I team, I'd want him. CJ Anderson's going to be a player. If I were going to get somebody out of go down Gun Forsett who played under Kubiak there, he was a free agent. I would have gotten him at a third the cost. So. All right. Spring football games. Give a darn. Sure. If you are somewhere other than this state, we talked about that this is not a great sports fan state. They drew 4,100 for whatever went on at Boulder. In Tennessee, where I went to school, and I'll put Peyton first, and a lot, they draw 75,000, 80,000 for a spring game. Texas draws 80,000. There in Texas, there are two seasons, only two seasons in Texas. There's football and there's spring football. Spring <laughs> football should be a grand moment for fans. Until it is not here in this state, with the teams, nobody knows when the games are. Is the correct phrase, I could care less or I couldn't, couldn't care less? Couldn't. I couldn't care less about spring football. It's an inner squad game. If you game. grew up somewhere where I don't it did, care. if don't you went care. to a school where it was. Don't care. I went to two 
schools you that value people. their football teams. I went to Illinois and I went to Arizona State. Yeah. Um, okay. Well, it was big there. Didn't care. You know, that's kind of interesting how you put the question. I couldn't care less. <laughs> Do you like the less. Papa John's so cookie you know. or the Papa John's brownie the most? Hmm. Or any chocolate no, chip I'm, cookie I, versus brownie? I'm with you. I'm with you. That, that brownie. Oof. The cookie is good. The brownie is great. I bought uh, five boxes of Girl Scout cookies yesterday. What flavors? Uh, trefoils. Add to that because we, we like trefoils. I love the do si -dos. And, the, and they got a new one this year with raisins in it. I said, I don't do raisins in my cookies. No Samoas? No. You don't get Samoas? No. Oh, they're the best. No, they just dribble the chocolate but on there. they're not as good as the Papa John's brownie, which yeah. is really... Are you doing it's, commercial? It's, it's, I, I, I mean, I love, it's chocolatey and it's, you put that in it's microwave. moist. You put that in the microwave and see how... I put it in my oven when they deliver it to yeah. me. You put it in the oven, heat the oven, yeah. and by the time you've gotten through the pizza, you want to eat that whole brownie. You put ice cream on it? Oh, no. I'm a diabetic. <laughs> oh, yeah. I'm only going to eat the brownies. I'm a diabetic <laughs> with my Coke. <laughs> with my Coca-Cola. Coke. Coke. All right. Yeah. All right. Uh, four on the Floor was brought to you by Citywide Banks. It's where the sports show <laughs> And Papa John's, <does> obviously. <laughs> all of its banking. <laughs>